imagine how dark it is at night without the lights, you know, on the farm in South Carolina. We didn't have electricity in my home. I came to Detroit at age 10, seeing all these lights and the movement and activity. It was like looking at a movie. I could hardly go to sleep. Well, I just simply introduced myself as Charles McGee, the artist. White and black, green and red. Those opposites are necessary to create harmony. I choose those colors, I choose the shapes in order to create that equilibrium. It's that duality in life that I try to exhibit in everything that I do. It's, it's saying that we can live together. Most of the energy that I've been able to generate has come out of trying to understand life. The beauty, the ugliness, art, to me, has been a pathway through this life that has been very rewarding. This is just my way of trying to make it better for someone else that's trying to understand and that's struggling too, you know. I feel that's why I was born. It's been a beautiful journey living in Detroit. It's been the sustenance of everything that I am, and it's taught me an awful lot from A to Z. Today, I see the city rising. Detroit is growing. I think its greatest strength is the vibrancy that comes out of strides of creativity and learning about the world around us. Community is a teaching process. And I think that always trying to teach and uh, understand, we become more forgiving of our failures. The Michigan Legacy Art Park is important because it's pulling together these elements and teaching us about the world around us. The beauty and the impact of being in situations of harmony and the wisdom that's in nature. When I discovered that I was receiving this award, I couldn't believe it. The Legacy Award is gratification for all of the time, energy, and devotion that I had wanted to give back to the community. I realize that a part of me, nature is claiming, I have no control over that, you know? It's, it's about time, you know? But why am I so eager to keep improving, to keep reaching, to keep trying to understand, you know? It's beyond me, but I do enjoy it.